Hello and welcome! In today's video we are looking at the Solid Mahogany Ukulele from Enya. The model that I'm looking at today is the blue one in the concert size. In this video I will share everything that you get when you order the ukulele, a plain demonstration, and we'll also play with some of the accessories. This ukulele has a solid mahogany top, solid mahogany back, mahogany sides, and a neck as well. This ukulele has a rich light fingerboard and a really beautiful and unique design on the headstock. The tuning pegs are A8 die cast and the nut and saddle are new bone. We have a rich light bridge and the strings are the Enya fluorocarbon. This ukulele has a radius rich light fretboard. This particular ukulele that I have for the video is a matte blue finish, but there's also a satin natural finish one that I will link down below. The ukulele comes with a padded gig bag and really great accessories, so let me open up the accessories bag and share those with you. And actually before I get into the accessories, this instrument comes with pre-installed strap buttons which are great for many reasons. Like when I was teaching children, I would play the ukulele and just turn into the back and help out a student. So the strap was something that I couldn't be without. So this instrument and the accessories included comes with the strap, but the strap buttons are already installed and they're in a gold color that matches the tuners. Something really great that we also get in the accessories is a capo. The capo is great for adjusting for your voice or if you have arthritis or your fingers hurt when you play, you can use a capo instead of playing bar chords and it's super handy. It's also great that you're getting a capo because this is ukulele sized. For a while there, all you could find in stores were the guitar capos and they're just not the right size for our instrument so I'm really happy that we get one. One accessory that you're going to use daily is the clip-on tuner. This is one that snaps onto the instrument and even though I have an app that tunes my instrument or helps me tune, that app operates by sound. So if there are other sounds playing in the background that are louder or more high-pitched, the phone picks up on those sounds instead of picking up on what I'm trying to tune. But the clip-on tuners operate by vibration, so when you put this on your instrument, it is only going to give you the reading for your instrument, making it super easy to tune. When it's time to replace the strings, no worries, and it has provided a set of replacement strings, and you also get picks in two different thicknesses. This might be a little weird, but my favorite accessory, well, aside from the tuner, my favorite accessory is the accessories bag itself. I use these for everything. I have one where I keep my agenda with highlighters and pencils and post-it notes. I put it on here. And then I have another one that I use for my makeup and toiletries. I know that like it's meant for these accessories, but it's just the perfect size for fitting everything that you need for a travel weekend. And I love it. Like you can be discreet, so you can have like your personal hygiene products and just have them in here and nobody will see them and it's sleek you know it's black i love it so i use this for everything now let's hear a playing demonstration Whenever the instruments go on sale, I share it on my Instagram story. So if you have Instagram, follow me there, check out the stories. I like to share whenever there's deals for them. So it's definitely a good opportunity to save some money. If you end up buying the instrument, please come back and let me know in the comments what you thought about it. I always love hearing your reviews and your experience with the instruments that I recommend in this channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you'd like to learn how to play ukulele, I have a 30 day uke challenge for beginners. I'm gonna put it right here. I highly recommend it. Or if you're already a seasoned player, then I recommend the 15 uke song challenge. It's just 15 songs. You start with a two chord song that's really easy and then you end up playing a more challenging song at the end. I think you'll have a lot of fun with that. Alrighty, I'll catch you in the next one. Ciao!